Ladies, gentlemen, and you beautiful in-betweens, hello and welcome back to TIE Fighter Special Edition. I'm Computer, and last episode, Harkov really showed his hand. He sent me into a minefield in a TIE Interceptor. No shields. And uh, actually, it was kind of easy to not get shot at, but I mean, there were only eight mines, so it wasn't too hard, but still bit of a scummy thing to do and also when I targeted the nearest enemy my wingman got targeted so kind of a dead giveaway so yeah he's uh, decided that he doesn't want to be in the Empire anymore problem is he has a ton of Thai advanced uh, ships and uh, yeah I can't really touch them with anything other than a Thai interceptor which doesn't have any shields so yeah, we'll see how this goes. For now, let's get into it. The successful interdiction of the supply convoy has left Victory Class Star Destroyer Protector stranded at the Rebel Station. The Thai advanced fighters that have given us so much trouble are now going to meet their match. Recon Squadron Mu's first group of Thai advanced will go to your unit. Yes! Now you will fight on equal ground. The next phase of the battle requires us to eliminate Harkov's fighters so he can be captured. Harkov's total strength outnumbers your force, but you will only be engaging a single flight group at a time. Alright. Um, come on. There we go. Good. I get to fly at high advanced. I'm kind of excited. And honestly, earnestly. Something like that. The objective is to destroy as many of Harkov's Thai advanced fighters as possible. 50% will be sufficient to allow the next phase of the attack to proceed. You will fly a Thai advanced designated Mu 2. Your flight group will consist of four Mu. Craft. For this mission, your craft has been loaded with a special armament of eight advanced concussion missiles. Remember, these missiles are faster, pack more punch, and have superior homing ability. Nevertheless, you will still find it very frustrating to try to acquire a lock at close range on a fast-moving target like a TIE Advanced. Instead, use them while you still have some range to work with, such as 1 to 2.5 kilometers. Good advice, honestly. Uh, um... Notice how he stopped telling me whether I'm the flight leader or a wingman? Victory class yeah. Star Destroyer Protector Weird. has as many as two squadrons of TIE Advanced Fighters. You need not get within range of the Rebel Platform or the Protector. Let the traitors come to you. Hmm. I'm pretty sure this guy is going to tell me differently. We expect more subterfuge from Harkov. We must establish his exact location. Inspect any Rebel transport or shuttle that you see. Harkov may be on board. If he is, God help him. Or the Emperor, uh, may the Emperor have mercy on his soul. Yeah, I'm gonna go with advanced missiles. Yes, there we go. Oh, right, yeah. Hyperdrive. That was a whole thing we went through to get those, yeah. Lock and load. Let's take down some traitors. All right. For each enemy fighter, use one missile, then finish with cannons. Right, right. Oh, that's interesting. Music just went away. Thank you. And I'm gonna take this time to 
Boy, there are a lot of you. Burgers. Um, good. Cover me. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Maybe they have better things to do. Oh, it looks like someone is following me. Maybe not. No, probably not. Anyway, I'm way faster than them, so... Yeah. Oh! Okay. Oh, we're dying. Uh, hmm. Let's see... Actually, let's check our goals here. Fifty percent of all Thai advance must be destroyed. Let's uh, up that percentage, I think, unless they overwhelm us somehow. And at least one of Mod Corvette Group Verger must be inspected. The way they phrase that, it feels like uh, I need to inspect a group, but I think they mean just one of the ships. Shuttle Toten uh, must be inspected. Hmm. Yeah. Wonder where that will come out. Like, these are way far off. Yeah, no. You really want me, okay? Well, you can't have me because you're way too slow. On the other hand, going back will be a problem, maybe. They're gonna be in range for, like, five kilometers. I'm probably gonna shoot a lot of missiles my way. Don't really like that idea. Let's get a little problem hitting me. Whoa! Okay, more problems. Yeah, that's a modified one, alright. Yes, yes. Very good. Very nice. Very... No, no, kind of good, sort of, maybe. Okay, some problem, uh, no. I mean, I've already told you to cover me, so shouldn't be too much of an issue. Okay, let's make it a little bit harder for you to catch up. I think we're successful. Good. Uh, did they mention something about the shuttle containing Harkov or something like that? Then it's... it's just the two of us now. I think we better go. And you are who? Mo one. Yeah, you you've been pretty badly hit actually. If I will be able to inspect that. And where are you? You're over there. Could be a problem. If you decide to go into hyperspace, like real now. Oh, yeah, the, um, yeah, of course. Uh, there's a minefield here. I kind of forgot about that mine. Oh, they're mine layers! That explains why it feels like there's a lot more mines when this thing started. It does make a lot of very unpleasant sense. Um, do I want to deal with that? Is that something I do wish to deal with? Let's just play with this guy for now. In the minefield, of course. Oh, thank you. Actual, like, fighting power now. I haven't hit him once. Uh, wait, that means there's only me. 
and I have to deal with 50% of all of these, that's going to be a problem. But let's check. Has there been any... Be interested to hear about these troop ships yeah of course but no totem yet also these shields are really tiny come on Ooh, one hit yay also I've noticed some problems with the joystick like not because I'm using the uh, x52 like what is it called? Professional from Logitech? Come on. Keep it up. Thank We're you. Halfway, halfway to 100 or halfway to... Okay, um, never mind you guys. Let's see, what do we have? So, no more mine layers, that's good. Hold on. Are there any more moose? Six more uh, Thai <laughs> advanced coming there. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a bit of a minefield there. And those guys, where are you guys going? Oh, you're going to probably me, yeah. This, oh no, you're... <laughs> There's always one in every group that's never quite on the ball, right? Exhilarating, isn't it? All these missiles? Oh, wow. Wait, what? Do I have friends here? And in, if so, then who are they? Oh, uh, right, okay. So I'm the only Moo. But we do have row, 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 row your boat. And maybe... No, they're, they're, they have H's, so they're Harkov's ships. Got it. Okay, I'm not alone. That's very heartening to know. Where did that uh, missile go, though? Ow. Let's go with that. Oh. I'm gonna hope that you weren't an enemy. Wait, 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 wait. Does it keep... Uh, some of you who have been watching this series for a while may know that I'm usually like I'll have one ship targeted and then like you start shooting another ship uh, like targets of opportunity essentially can't really do that here when we're all flying the same ship or the same type of ship thank you so where was you come on 
There we go. Totem. You got it. I don't have any wingmen to ask to. Victory class star destroyer protector is entering hyperspace. We should yep. report this. Oh, God. Can I just shoot him right now? Remember, Lord Vader wants Harkov alive. Oh, okay, never mind. Um, right. Yeah, I haven't finished the mission yet. So, kind of celebrating a little bit too early. And I was shooting too late. Come on. Thank you. Oh, wow. Like, the victory music is still playing, and we're not out of this, even by a long shot. But it's kind of just cleanup that's remaining. Also, the Star Destroyer still hasn't left for hyperspace, so that's an interesting thing. Come on. Anyway, uh, I've noticed that there's a problem with the joystick, and it's not the problem with the fact that I'm using an X-52 this time, which has been an issue before. But no, uh, this time it's that the game has a dead zone, which makes... Ooh, ah, which makes... Okay, yeah, I'm gonna keep going for a bit. Yeah, 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 whatever. Now, uh, small movements are basically impossible, and he's flying straight down, that's a problem. Like, there's a dead zone, so if I want to move just a few pixels to center a shot, it almost always overshoots, or like overcompensates, and I have to go to slightly to the other side, and then it just goes back and forth like that. Bit of an issue. Especially when you're trying to line up uh, like a missile or something. Although, then, not so much, but a shot at a missile, maybe. That ow. Also, I should probably leave the area for a bit and come on. Yeah, let's go that way. Go like so. Like, this is a good way to just avoid being shot. Like, those ships can't really hit me now. The AI just doesn't know what to do. And I think we'll be able to see me die now. Maybe. Can we... Yeah, that missile probably is not going to be able to do anything to me. Also, I'm, I, it seems I am just as fast as the missile for some reason. That's an interesting thing. That's also interesting. Like, the missiles slow down after a bit. Wonder if I'll be able to use that. Did they just hit each other? Um, let's go with that. Also, why do you keep going up? That's very... Like, I'm not touching that uh, part of the joystick ever. Unless I truly want to. And... I was just about to ask if they had run out of missiles. No such luck. Three in a row. It's um, one. Where did the other two go? Oh well, um... Oh, 
Oh well. Very far away. Maybe this will be a little bit easier. Let me fire twice as much and also miss twice as much, maybe. I think maybe my friends over at Row have left. That makes a lot of sense to me right now. Yeah, uh, and about how to actually do that, like, evasive roll thing I just did. It's real simple. Just, like, the thing you're even running towards... Uh, no, wait, uh, let me rephrase that. If you're running towards someone, then you put them in the lower quarter of your forward radar, and then just turn left or right. And if you're running from someone, put them in the top order of your radar and turn left and right. It's like real simple and the AI has no idea what to do with that information. Like they can't hit you. And it goes for uh, things like the capital ships and fighter as well. And as we have found out, it works for missiles too. It works best if you have a very fast ship though. So, yeah. Stop. Did you hit each other? Come on. I'm really bad at dogfighting these days. Thank you. And I don't really want to go into hyperspace uh, in this, like, ball of ships that can blow me out of the sky with, like, maybe four shots. Because my shields are not big. They're not impressive at all. Yeah, I just heard someone hitting themselves. Maybe what I want is a beam weapon, like a tractor beam. That would be very nice. Uh, well. Bonus call to let him live. That's interesting. That's weird and interesting. Whoa. My accuracy on this mission is going to be atrocious, I think. Uh, is this the last ship, or do I go for 100%? Just to spite them. was a wasted shot. 
completely. I mean, there was just no way for me to hit him there. Uh, kind of want to re remove the minefield just to spike them too, but that's way overkill. And again, I can't destroy the platform because the waiter wants him alive. Demanding bosses can be so problematic, don't you agree? Yeah, it's just three or uh, four more, so though no, this is probably all of them actually. Like all I see over at the like the radar over at the platform is green and white. Ow. That was not gonna lie, that was a sweet move he did there. Would have been even sweeter if he had actually taken a shot at me. Give me ion cannons. Also, this is kind of like training for me, because, uh, I mean, dogfighting was never really my thing, as we have this, uh, Established plenty of times. Also, yeah, that. Now you did this with me. Well, you're not the same guy that did it before, but oh well. Whoa! Come on. So a little bit of training to get better at hitting my enemies. Like that. And that. Than that. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna stop that now. I'm gonna put in a time code, so like at the start of this, and you'll say a whole bunch of uh, shooting and just dogfighting and let you skip entirely. Just because I'm nice like that, I guess. Not nice enough to edit it out, but yeah. Come on. Oh, you're kind of hurt, huh? Are you gonna go cry to mommy? No, you're going to go into... Yeah, you are going to go to Molly. Huh. Not going to happen. Actually, if Mothership is like Mommy, then wouldn't the platform be like... Never mind. Um, let's not go with that. That that feels like a rabbit hole. I'd rather not go into. Also, stereotypical gen uh, gender roles. Not a fan. But for a joke, I'll riff on it, I guess. Come on. Thank you. That felt good. Come on. 
Get in range. Get in my sights. them. Sure we. Maybe a few entered into hyperspace or something? Alright, what did we get? Nothing. Should I destroy them? I mean, I have eight more missiles. Actually, I haven't used a single missile. Let's see what happens. Also, that's weird movements you have there. Like you're trying to move or follow a flight pan path or flight path, sorry. But it's just not working out for you. Should I get cool? Well, let's go with you. I can deal with you and see what happens. Or maybe you can deal with me and see what happens. That's also a possibility of uh, things that could go potentially really bad. Ow. Let's put you up there, around there, I guess. Uh, and then like so, and so. Bad idea, but... Oh, wow. Do we get anything for that? No. So, let's get out of range, and then go into hyperspace. There we go. That felt kind of good. Not the getting hit at the end there, not into that, but felt good to actually get to fly the TIE Advanced for once. Let's see... Uh, I'm, an ad uh, I'm a general now? Also, yeah, we kind of expected that, honestly. So, yeah. One of five. I suspect destroying the mine layers, maybe one, and then destroying... No, you probably can't be asked to destroy the Star Destroyer. That would be fun, though. Uh, maybe destroying the other Verger, uh, Verger. The other Burger. Uh, maybe one? I don't know. Four space objects. Yay! And I destroy 16 TIE Advanced. Do you like that? And we lost all of my wingmans. Again, none from Ro, though. Interesting. Did not expect that. Why were they By so much better? so many of Harkov's fighters, you have prepared the way for a final assault on the Protector and the Rebel base. The departure of the Protector is assumed to be temporary, because Harkov was observed entering the platform during the battle. It seems unlikely that he would abandon his command in such circumstances, but then his defection seemed unlikely too. Yeah. Well, um, I mean... They kind of broke the fourth wall by showing us him talking with the rebels, but uh, yeah. Let's see what you have to say. Uh, also, yes, General. 
Nice. Your inspection of the shuttle delivering Harkov to the platform has forced a change in our plans. We were preparing an assault to board and capture Victory Class Star Destroyer Protector. Now our target will be the platform. This will be a somewhat easier task, so be grateful. That, that's actually interesting. Like both him and the other guy were talking about Harkov going to the platform. I wonder if I hadn't inspected the ship, would he still be talking about uh, Harkov entering the platform? That's interesting. Didn't expect that. But, yeah. That was an interesting mission, honestly. And, like I said, good training. But uh, let's move on. Admiral Harkov has, for unknown reasons, taken refuge on the Rebel outpost. Victory Class Star Destroyer Protector has fled. Mines have been deployed around the station, and Rebel reinforcements are rushing to rescue Harkov. Recon Squadron Mu will send TIE Advanced Fighters and Assault Gunboats to join with Special Operations Stormtroopers aboard Assault Transports. The Assault Gunboats and TIE Advanced Fighters will take out any remaining fighter defenses and clear the minefield. The assault transports will arrive three minutes after the assault gunboats and begin the assault on the platform. Assault gunboat Mu and the assault transports will disable the platform and any craft attempting to escape. The stormtroopers will conduct boarding operations and take control of the platform. Lord Vader will arrive aboard the Imperial Star Destroyer Garrett. Oh, wow. Harkov will be brought to him. Admiral Harkov has for us. This is a pretty big thing, honestly. I also back in the gunboats again, so that's uh, less than fun. But uh, oh well. On the other hand, I do like my ion cannons, so there's that. The objective is to capture Admiral Harkov. He was last observed entering the Rebel platform DS5. He is probably waiting for the protector to return but may attempt to escape when he realizes our intent. It will be your responsibility to disable any craft leaving the platform. The platform and all disabled craft will be captured. When Lord Vader arrives, Admiral Harkov will be brought to him. You will fly an assault gunboat designated Mu-2. Your flight group will consist of four craft. For this mission, your craft has been loaded with the standard armament of 16 concussion missiles. Your strike team will also include a flight group of TIE Advanced to deal with enemy fighters. Three minutes into the attack, you will be joined by Assault Transport Group Omega. Assault Transport Group Omega will have heavy rockets to take down the platform shields quickly. Be prepared to lend assistance if necessary. The Starfighter defenses yeah. were substantially reduced during your last mission, but reinforcements may have arrived since then. If so, your first task will be to work with TIE Advanced Group Alpha to eliminate them. After that is the Rebel platform itself. It is well armed and a minefield was observed being laid. The mines are the new Type 3. These have the nasty habit of launching oh, wow, a yeah. craft that destroys them. Yeah, I've fought with those before. Uh, they're pretty nasty. Kind of suicidal, though, honestly. Although, I mean, they're not alive, so yeah. The fact that the protector left kind of bothers me. Like, if it went to get more, like, TIE Advanced ships somewhere, and then returned and just disgorges them in the middle of this fight that could be bad i don't have any memory of that happening though then again i haven't played this game for like 25 years so who knows and yeah let's uh, see what our se uh, secondary uh, objectives will be probably identifying basically everything you must ensure that Admiral Harkov is captured. As you disable craft fleeing from the rebel platform, be sure to inspect them as well. He must be apprehended. Yeah. Inspect, inspect, inspect. Yeah, let's do this. 
Also, can I? I can. And I was supposed to get 16. Let's see if that's still the case. Yeah, the TIE Advance doesn't... Like, it looks very different from... Like, in style and fidelity. It looks very different from these, uh, like, the TIE Fighters, TIE Interceptors, and the Gunboat, and etc. Odd. Oh, well. Also, again, it sounded like a TIE Fighter going away. Right, let's see what we have in terms of goals. Mines, yes. Uh, disable, disable, disable. Shuttle, transport, Corellian transport. Got it. And the platform needs to be captured. Inspected, inspected, inspected. All right. Well, and in terms of ships, we have some X-wings on and some gold wings and a whole lot of mines. Uh, can I? Yes, I can. So basically nine times two, so 18 mines. I wonder if I can disable them and if that makes them stop firing. That's very... I need to test that. And the three ships that I need to inspect and disable are already there. Interesting. Uh, let's see. F5 for you, F6 for you, and F7 for you. Sorry, F7 for you. Um, I'm pretty sure this one is a lot faster than me, actually. Should I actually start with Totem? I kind of have a feeling that, that, that he's not in there. It would make sense that he's not. So let's start with you. Or maybe you? No. And then send my friends on that. I'm going to start with this. Because it's the fastest one, I think. I think it can actually even outpace me. Which isn't grand. Interesting, I'm just out of range of most of them. Whoops. What the hell? Stop doing that. Harkov, right. Oh, wow. Um... Fifty, that's not grand. Um, and now you're down to... Whoops. Yeah, that might have been a little bit overkill. Um, give me power, thank you. Because he's about to go out of range, sort of. Thank you. That was kind of... Uh, not grand. Um... 28%. Let's hope he survives. And let's get the shuttle, actually. Oh, you're this already on the... That's not great. Um... We should have guessed it would be a decoy. Yeah, because I've already found him. And get away, no... Also, get away. That's that's kind of funny, actually. Oh, you're already good. Then I just need to inspect you. Um, good. Oh, not good. Uh, I need to destroy all of the mines now. Or disable most of them, I guess. Good, unknown, and not known. Let's see. Oh, well. Can you still shoot? Did 
there. Just gonna. Oh, wow. So even if they're disabled, that's interesting. Let's see. All right. Very nice. Now we get to have some fun with people who look like they're shooting me. Actually, I'm going to deal with you now. Do I want to waste my missiles on this guy? I don't think it would help all that much, honestly. Oh. Interesting. Something just blew up. Less fun, but also interesting. And bit close for comfort there. Yeah, the the wow. I didn't realize that ion cannons could just outright destroy. Yeah, didn't go too well with that guy. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Garrett, got it. Let's go back to killing. Let's see what we have. We have you, decoy. We have you, rebels. We have you, Harkov. At 28%, that... Mm. Ah. What cleanup? Also, like DS5, I may have mentioned it before, but like, but yes, 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 good. Like, just commenting, like, not DS9. It might be, although this came out in 94, so maybe not, but it might be like uh, an amalgamation. 38%? Hold on. Yeah, it could be an amalgamation of Babylon 5 and Deep Space Nine, too. Although I don't know when those started running on, like, on air. Could just be, like, uh, something completely generic. But uh, it's my headcanon and I'm sticking to it. Transport uh, two more. Um. Shell Totem was destroyed, did we? I uh, don't believe, although... Oh, there you are. Bonus goal was boarded. It... well, I mean, why would they board uh, a decoy? That makes very small sense. Um, but I am worried. Slightly worried. Maybe I should have told them to ignore it. Also, like, you guys. Go have fun with that. Adam. That's... Carrot. That's Olinor. Hold 
hold on. That's a very weird icon for a Star Destroyer, don't you think? Very weird. Mm -hmm. uh, if they pick a fight, it's probably not going to end well for them. Like, a frigate against an actual Star Destroyer? What was that? Something glittered over there. Let's see what they actually said. Two more Rebel Starships. Have two more? Ver oh, you guys too, huh? Maybe I leave the frigate to the Star Destroyer. Although, no, it's about two and a half. I think they could fight each other out while I go deal with these Corvettes if I can find them somewhere. Probably. No. Nope. 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 There we go. Capture operation complete. We've taken control of the traitor's ship. Very good. Very good indeed, in fact. Uh, yeah, the, the, the joystick is a little bit like... I want to go straight for that guy, but I keep going just slightly above or slightly below which will mess up my aim. Now I think I might be perfectly on. On the other hand, when I get in range, it's going to start shooting at me, which I don't like. Come on. So, yeah, it has a dead zone issue. I know it's fixed in, like, X-Wing Alliance, but this game doesn't have quite that amount of luck. Why aren't you shooting at me any yet? Troops, you say? No match speed. Makes things a lot easier. Ooh. That's also interesting. Eh, I mean, I could just kill it, I guess. I wonder why that frigate just came here. Actually, like, what was the purpose of all of that? And what about these two? Like, they... That guy didn't even fire a single shot at me. Come on, let me let me aim at you, please. Also, it isn't helped by the fact that every time I make a slight movement, it still has a little drift. I forgot to actually look at what the ship was carrying. No, troops, troops. It's not like I'm going to use them for anything else right now. Getting a proper lock on these guys when they're far away, when you, every time you move the joystick just a little bit. Thank you. Too. 
Well, where did you... Oh, you entered the hangar. Got it. What are you about? Report? Flying home. Very, very odd mission this. Oh, what was that? Oh, nice. More enemies to have fun with. Oh, that's a lot of them, actually. actually hit you like I can't oh, frustrating see how are how are our goals burger destroyed transport imported Korean ghetto I captured yeah, that I like to get away. Get away car. Yeah. Fast one, too. Uh, yeah, I'm okay with this. Kind of worried about, like, what's the point of those two? They don't feel like what they came out of hyperspace, I think. Uh, yeah, assault transport Omega 5 and 6 entering area at 5 kilometers. Flying home, flying home, and then immediately well, no, pretty much immediately afterwards. 30 seconds afterwards, we get five A-wings. That's a bit of a distraction. But it did say just troops. Oh, um, why can't I? Okay, I'm not supposed to go here. I'm supposed to go to that thing, I think, <laughs> or just hyperspace, maybe. Also feels likely. <clears throat> yeah, I think that's actually that thing there. There we go. Hyperspace. And we're good. Odd mission. Um, I would be questioning and questioning a lot of things, honestly. Welcome, Admiral Harkov. We have a matter to discuss. What is the location of your fleet? <laughs> now you shall pay for your treachery. He hasn't answered yet. Never mind. No, oh, that's very nice. But still like the one I got two medals before uh, ago. Oh. Did 
This is new. Welcome to the inner circle. Yeah, I'm still questioning how he can use force powers. Like, it was supposed to be... Although, I mean, in the EU, uh, extended universe, basically he had quite a few people that could use the force, like Mara Jade, for instance. I got a medal and so much more. 85%, 71%, very nice. Three of four bonus goals. What would the fourth be? It can't be, like, capturing the decoy. Maybe if I had told my wingmen to ignore it, I would have known. I would have been able to find out. Sorry. Yes. Anyway, I can live with this. Mm, well, I did take out two of the seven Ave Wings. Yeah. And yeah. Captured. Right, right, right. Wait, what? We didn't lose a single ship? That seems very unlikely and very unlike us as well. All of our primary mission objectives were met. Admiral Harkov will be interrogated by Mr. Has been. Vader. The location of Victory Class Star Destroyer Protector and the rest of Harkov's band of defectors will be discovered. Yeah, I think you're going to be a little bit disappointed about that because he didn't have time to answer, honestly. But uh, we don't question Lord Wager around here. Do we? Yes, yes. Uh, seen that already. You inspected all of the craft leaving the platform, thereby discovering which one Harkov was on. Also, you were instrumental in the capture of the platform. I don't remember that bit, but if you say so, like, sure, embellish my stories a little bit more. And that was Battle Five. And honestly, I really like this one. Uh, some of the missions were a little bit on the nose, like that, yeah. Just, uh, still sits wrong with me that uh, they sent me into a minefield in a TIE Interceptor. Yeah, it's just not done. Like, yeah. And while I was doing that, I was also getting a few more medals, like the tire advanced and the gunboat like i forgot that uh in the combat chamber here they're listed out of order like you get tie fighter tie interceptor and then tie bomber i think the tie bomber should be the second uh, second ship you get to fly around in and then tie advanced and then assault gunboat which i feel is kind of weird and then, yeah, not going to touch those just yet. And yeah, so with that, ladies, gentlemen, and you beautiful in-betweens, I've been Computer. This has been TIE Fighter Special Edition. Thank you for watching, and I hope to see you next time.